Sarah, let's talk batteries. Some exciting news for Photocentric this week. Uh, can you tell us what it is? Yes, so we have started our program on 3D printing batteries. So um, we have got some grant funding for developing 3D printed batteries. So on the one hand, focusing on new um, methods to fabricate batteries, not only the battery electrodes, but the full battery cell as well. So at the moment, yes, batteries, um, if you look, for example, at all the electric vehicles, the battery pack is taking a very, very large um, volume of the whole car and uh, therefore also of the weight. So our cars have a much smaller range than they could actually have if our batteries were better. And so with 3D printing, we have a lot of options. On the one hand, we can control the geometry of the battery, so the macro geometry of the battery, but we can also control the micro geometry of the battery. And with that, I mean the geometry of the electrodes, both the geometry and the porosity of the electrodes. We have a complete freedom of geometry. So we can fabricate batteries which are made to fit a vehicle rather than a vehicle made to fit a battery. The thought of actually manufacturing a battery by 3D printing is something very novel, which at the beginning seemed too blue sky research. So it took a lot of, of thought and a lot of reading and a lot of writing to actually think about how 3D printing could really benefit the battery industry and how, how you can fabricate a better battery. It's uh, revolutionary because that gives us um, a whole new direction of how we can look at transport at the end. We can, we can make batteries not only for cars, we can make batteries for drones, for example. We can, make, um, we can look and, into how to fabricate new battery chemistry. So I think with this, we can actually revolutionize the, the way batteries are currently manufactured and the way we move forward. <laughs>